Hello all, welcome to a very special edition of Food Sack, coming to you live from the iconic Queen Street Mall Hungry Jacks. This Hungry Jacks truly sits alongside the Story Bridge, King George Square, and Stephen Sky Needle as one of the most enduring images of this beautiful city. It has not one, not two, but three luxurious dining areas open 24 seven and located next to some newly refurbished public toilets. So what better place than their flagship store to try out their brand new Jacks fried chicken pieces? What do you say? Let's give these pieces a chance. Alrighty, so I have my uh, three piece right here in this bag. Three pieces of Jack's fried chicken. Let's have a look. There we go. Um, they look okay. Let's take them out. Now these are actually a little bit smaller than I was expecting. I was expecting these to be basically the uh, the fillets that they put in the burgers, but it's not. And given the price, that's quite a surprise because these are a bit expensive. But anyway, let's give them a taste. What? Pretty hot, but um, very flavoursome. You can see the uh, the meat there, it's real meat. That is real chicken breast. Mm. You can... Um, hang on. Just had to wait for the eches to pass. Um, this is pretty good. The um, the coating on here is not as sophisticated as the uh, as the KFC coating is. KFC has the eleven secret herbs and spices. Hungry Jacks uses the Bevan secret herbs and spices. It's just some guy called Bevan came up with some spices to put on the uh, on the Hungry Jacks, and they're pretty good. They're not bad, but. Um, I think the, the marinade of the chicken is really where a lot of the flavor comes from. And of course the salt and possibly MSG if they use MSG, I'm not sure, but you can taste the salt. Mm. Yeah, well, very edible, not disagreeable at all. But um, a lot of people have been complaining that these are a bit expensive and I tend to agree being in the um, in the prime position here, the uh, centerpiece store of uh, Hungry Jacks across Australia. This um, this is a bit pricey. This was like nine dollars something. Um, I forget the price exactly, but it was that much. So you know, for like not a lot of meat, that's um, not great. Although it is pretty good quality meat. I do like being in this store. It's open 24 hours. It offers three floors of deluxe dining experience. It also has a wide range of customers, including incredibly loud children and uh, and some eches. So everyone you could want in a store. And sitting here as well, I do get a very good view of the uh, of the McDonald's that came in and took over from. Uh, from Stefan's restaurant. That was a dark day for Brisbane when McDonald's moved into that place. I hope you can hear me over those kids. They are super loud. So, yeah, I don't know if the price here is right. They're not bad. They are better than the nuggets, I suppose, but they're really not that different from like the chicken tendies you can get at Woolworths. So I don't know if I would uh, fully endorse these. Hang on, I just forgot. I got sauce with these. I got sauce. I forgot to check out the sauce. Here we go. I got some uh, spicy sauce. I was tempted by the plum barbecue sauce, but I uh, I got the spicy. Let's see it goes w with the spicy sauce. Uh, just open that up. Oh Jesus! All right, let's have a go. Very creamy sort of peri peri looking spicy sauce here. Let's give that a go. Mmm. Yeah, that adds a new dimension. A new dimension. I would say it improves it. You probably do need the sauce with these. 
But that said, you probably don't need these at all. I think the fillet from the uh, from the Jack's Fried Chicken Burger is a bit superior. Or maybe it just seems that way because it's surrounded by bread and lettuce, making it taste better. But yeah, I don't know. If you like nuggets, give these a go. But if not, don't bother. It is a snack-sized meal for a meal-sized price. So I don't know if you really want that. Anyway, I am going to go for a little walk around King George Square and possibly get a free carrot from this Easter thing they have outside. So many thanks for watching. Make sure to come into this Hungry Jacks next time you're in Brisbane. Tell them Food Sack sent you. Cheers.